As you guessed by the title, I was headed to Panama. I was going to see my business partners and we were going to take care of some business. Now, Panama is known mainly for its canal, its natural attractions, and banking. Before I get into all the Panamanian fun, this video was sponsored by my favorite, Cuts Clothing, made in Los Angeles. Check out the link in my description to buy the only shirts you'll ever need. And I promise you guys will love them. I love them. I wear them everywhere all over the world. They also just released their spring collection, so be sure to check it out. I bought the whole collection, and I know you will too. We're out here today, finally picking up the camera. Say what up, my G. Got a hydrate for this crazy hike we're about to go on. Insane. <laughs> crazy hike. Panama, my fourth day here, first day leaving the condo. What's up, fool? Look at that view. Where are we going, down there? After being on lockdown all weekend, the boys decided to take me out for a little stroll on the streets of Panama City. Fuck, it was hot. So we were on lockdown all weekend. It's Monday, we're out, going for a quick walk. Wow, it is hot. Here we go, Panama, pretty much day one, even though it's day four. Now, Panama City was a huge city with a population of almost two million, and there was tons of amazing food and chiquitas for all you horn dogs out there watching this video. The place was massive, skyscrapers everywhere. It reminded me of Latin New York. The Panama Canal is an artificial waterway about 40 miles in Panama and it connects the Atlantic Ocean to the Pacific Ocean. Over 25,000 workers died during the construction of the Panama Canal. What's the plan today, boys? Get shopping and send a lot of Bitcoin somewhere. A little Dodge no coin. All right, so it's like day five here in Panama. I'm headed out to the mall right now, so hopefully I'll be able to show you guys some cool shit. Right to spend some of that do doge coin. <laughs> it's a nice mall. What's this area called again? Casco Viejo. Casco Viejo. Casco Viejo. Something like that. So this is a crazy sushi restaurant and rooftop lounge up here. All these are rooftop lounges that have like. What's it called again? Skoka Sushi. Is this your date? Yeah, I'm actually just dipping her. The amount of construction here is crazy. Good things coming soon. My ball showing? Just got to the W. This room is large. This is one of the best W hotel rooms I've ever seen in my life, and maybe one of the best hotel rooms I've ever seen in my life. Now, this place could fit like a family of eight, but it's just me here, so what the hell? Might as well see the property. You guys ready? Let's go! You guys know I travel a lot and I stay in a lot of hotels. So I actually enjoy making these little hotel commercials. But if you do go to Panama, make sure to check out and check in to the W Panama. This place is amazing.
W Hotel right downtown in the middle of Panama City, Panama. The room is amazing. Service, extraordinary. Hold for the food, we're gonna get to that shortly. But yeah, check out this view. Okay, so I'll be honest with you guys, I came to Panama, I've been here for like a week, came here for some work stuff. Everything's kind of shut down, so it wasn't much to see and explore, but it does look like a very cool city. If I could describe it, it's like if New York City and Mexico had a baby, it would be something like Panama. Just out here about to have a little breakfast to myself. Benny. Just finished breakfast, gonna go check out the pool, see what's going on over here. This is one of the best gyms I've ever seen in a hotel. This place looks like Equinox, it's crazy. Okay, so it's locked down here in Panama on the weekends. You gotta stay in your building. I'm at the W Hotel, great place to be locked up. Trying out their food, and I gotta say, holy shit, look at that. How's that for presentation? What is that? Pineapple cheesecake, holy. And then we got the club sandwich over here. I'm gonna enjoy this and check in with you guys another day, another time, ciao. Last day at the W in Panama. Honestly, I wanted to make a kick-ass video for you guys during this trip, but the city is closed down pretty much. There's a 9 p.m. curfew. Last 48 hours, Let's fucking do this, bruh. Adios, putas. Just to give everyone an update, it is the weekend here in Panama, and on the weekends, you have to stay home. You're not allowed out. My dumbass made my dates at the W Friday, Saturday, check out Sunday. So I gotta check out, but if I hit a police checkpoint, I'm in a lot of fucking trouble. Look at the streets, they're empty. Literally, nobody. I basically have to get from here to like, way over there. Hopefully with no police checkpoints. And uh, I'm gonna to call a taxi and uh, hope for the best. So my Spanish is a little rusty. Stay tuned, because I'm going to film it. Fuck it, let's see what happens. successful. Nobody on those streets. There's police stops at random everywhere. Not gonna lie, I was shitting my pants. Oh, that's me vlogging. Shitting my pants. Hoping I didn't get stopped and I didn't. Mission success. I'm not going to Panamanian jail. Whoop, whoop. I was talking about in the vlog how uh, I was almost went to jail if I got caught getting over here. But in the vlog, can you see the police stop from here or no? It's like under the bridge. It doesn't look Over here on this side? See on the left hand side, there's like an overpass. Oh yeah, yeah, oh right underneath yeah, it. Yeah. Shit, I see them actually. There is a police dog. That's it for my Panamanian adventures. I will be back to experience this great city when it's fully open and coronavirus is a thing of the past. Stay tuned because next week I'm off to a new place I've never been for my birthday, guys. So hit that like and subscribe or go fuck yourself.